you know, since they want that uh, the spirit of uh, VRE, Ghanaians have been with us all this while, your support, the zeal, the encouragement and all that, we are very grateful because had it not been you, you will be nothing. But so the damage cost is still there and then we are praying that government will come in so that they will come and give us all this thing, our structures back. We want to go back to our, our various houses. As you can see, many more of us are living under tents. And uh, it's not comfortable during daytime like this, the heat, even in the night. And then now that the rain pattern is also setting in, you could see, clearly see that we are not comfortable at all. And then even living in the classroom after taking bath, your wife is not, uh, cannot have her privacy. You as a man, you also don't have your privacy. And uh, all of that, I mean, are problems that are confronting us. And then also, we are pleading with the uh, Ministry of Food and Agriculture. They should come in this time. We need uh, farming equipment. We need agrochemicals so that we can go. The rain pattern is already here. So we want to go back to our farms so that uh, we restore whatever. And uh, the, fishing, the fish industry is also affected. We are pleading with them. Ministry of Fisheries should also come. Many people, I mean, uh, canoes has been taken away. Their fishing equipment has been taken away. This is a farming and fishing community. We are pleading with Ghanaians. They should help us back so that we can restore uh, our livelihood.